this video I would like to share another uh, important symbol um, uh, in shamanism and Altai shamanism especially. Uh, it's a symbol or a river of life. A river of life uh, it's a symbol which represents time and same as a time, time is flow, we feel it and we can sense the time. Uh, we say that river of life is a flow as well and we imagine that the beginning of the river of life is located in the future world of the sky, world of Ulgi. Then this river of life coming to the present, to the place of Umai. And we are living in the present, actually we uh, are now in the present. And then uh, it's coming to the past, to the Erlik. Actually the end of the river of life is at the Erlik place. And uh, how to work with the symbol, how to uh, work with the energy of the future, past and the present. And uh, if you are connecting with Tengri, and the last video was about Tengri, then the time has disappeared. There is no time, there is no present, no past, no, uh, no future, because it's a timeless. All happen in the same time. But we are living in the place where the, those three uh, times exist, future, past and the present. And very important to, to work with uh, both Oh, three of them important to work with the future important to work with the past and with the present How to imagine that how to imagine this river of life and how to sense the river of life? We say that in front of us is a future because we're always going to the future Behind us actually our back. It's our past behind us as a past and what is in you what uh, happened with you now it's a present and as I already said, the river of life starts from the future, from the sky, and then going to the past, to the Erlik. And it means the stream of the river of life going this way, going through you, and uh, everything what happened become your history, your past. And every moment, the river of life uh, bring you some situations. And those situations can be neutral, can be positive, can be negative, can be very negative. And when the situation is neutral, it's very easy to go through you. It doesn't uh, bothering you at all. And then it's simply become your past, that situation. But when the situation is positive, it's also go through you. It's a little bit make you up uh, with energy. You feel good, you feel well. And then it's also become your uh, history, your past. But when the negative situation coming through you, for example, the life stream, uh, river of life, bring you some negative situation. That's another question why that happened. Yeah? If you're interested, we can talk about that uh, in another videos. Why the life bring you negative situation? Of course, it's uh, based on karma, based on your previous lives and many, many other things. And then negative coming through you, very often it's very difficult to let it go. I mean, if something bad happened, it's uh, bothering you. It's, uh, we say, taking part of your soul. And then this situation um, also becoming your history, your past. But the situation is not uh, really uh, that what you let go. You're still holding the connection with that situation. And that's how it works that we start to connect with the past. And the more negative situation happened with you in your past, and more uh, psychic traumas you have in your past, the more difficult for you to uh, to let go of the past because past is holding you. Because uh, what happened, you cannot uh, digest. You cannot really let go because the there's still pain from that past. There's still part of your soul left you and stay with that situation. And of course, uh, it's a part of the spiritual development to use such a situation, difficult situation in your life or problem situation or traumas and try to uh, try to digest it, try to uh, let it go, try to not fix it too much about it and not too much suffer about it. Uh, it's mean it's a way of letting go. And letting go, it's very, very important part of spiritual development, it's an important part of 
uh, shamanic work uh, about cleansing about change your life and of course and we all different and we have different lessons in our life but anyway we have to learn that learn to let go and we all have uh, difficulties in our uh, life uh, stream or you can say river of life and a river of life bring us difficulties constantly and we need to learn how to handle them and handle them it's mean learning to let go again in front of you it's a future behind you is a past what is in you it's a present and uh, you can sense the stream of river of life every moment and every moment something coming like now you get this video you watch that you experience that and it's also become your experience and very important to to learn as well like learning process it's a process of uh, getting more conscious and I really advise you to learn more and be more conscious and using a symbol river of life in your uh, in your spiritual work and yeah if you like video please uh, put your like uh, below and uh, subscribe for the channel and see you another time uh, with a new wisdom thank you